Hello viewers, welcome back. A lot of talk about Andre Kramaric. The next installment of in Steven Gerrard. Here we go. We're away to Leicester here. Comes to you from the from the thanks for tuning in again viewers. My name is Derek Ray. Like the video, you share it with your mates if you can. Me, Sub to the channel if you can viewers. I hope the channel will grow. From the Premier League, it's Leicester City. Up again, chances on. That's it by Isaacs back in back in the score and for them boys. Well here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. I'm trying to that it, I'm actually a still some like viewers I'm trying to record as many view as many episodes as I can. Whenever I'm still off work here because I'm not gonna re record as much whenever I'm back to work. So I'm, I'm trying to record enough that well, not the greatest we'll be able to we'll be able to have it going all week now. Target, the cut back. Well, he hit it with authority. Close. But in the future, I'll not be up. I'll not be up every day next week. Or I'll not be up every day in future viewers, it's just because I'm not able to record a lot more, but I'll see what I can do, but oh, that, nice that's why it's important that you, you sub the uh, sub to the channel Indeed. doesn't cost anything viewers. It, 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 well, it, it doesn't here. cost you anything. It's just like following me. So that means that you um, put the wee bell on and that well, puts the notifications on and that will tell you whenever it was uploaded so that you, you didn't miss it. Just it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. So back underway, they've leveled it at 1-1 here. And it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. That still could be dangerous. And in the end, no damage done. I, st I streamed the, the Liverpool game the day there, viewers. Otavio. So let's just don't run know, up and I and the, the, really the Arsenal to the four, defensively. The Arsenal force game's actually on right now. Oh, what a save, oh, keeper. Save. Great goalkeeping. We need, we need to keep picking up wins by being the Champions League next season. So we can't afford to drop any points. Later to the box. Uh, Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Sam Maxima. Why is he catching him? here Renan Lodi Oh there's no way I should have that ball there Andre Kramaric Mendy with it Moving into the advanced position A very effective challenge put in Now out on the flank. Laid it to the center. Oh, what a goal, boys! I didn't want to hit the shot too soon because if I hit it too soon, I didn't want to take a touch. I wanted him to hit it in the volley, but I knew if I hit it too soon, he'd end up just jumping up and heading it straight at the keeper. Let's 
see this again because the delivery into the box Lovely could be any better. There. Played into just the right area, but you have to question the defending here. They don't we'll attack the ball when it comes price. in. They don't react quickly enough to close the score down. It's really poor defending. I'm happy with the score well, view. The only thing I'm not happy here. about is centre midfield. We definitely need a big centre midfielder in there. I'm not talking big as in height, but you know a big name. 83 or 84 rated. Someone that's quick. Someone that's sort of quick. But is also sort of another one too small. And good with, good with shots. And like a back to the box midfielder. Working hard at the defensively as well. He has time to play it over. A glorious chance. Coutinho, and a goal what a freaking me player Coutinho is, boys. One of our one of our best signings, I would say, so far. happens here what's going on stupid thing freaking wire can they wire in the controllers list sometimes boys and like sometimes you just move it it just messes up like that Coutinho. Just keep the ball, boys. Keep the ball. Luis Felipe with it. Keep the ball. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Well, you can really sense the frustration building around the stadium. They've been so poor today, way below their usual standard. Excellent passing. Ah, Fine so tackle nice there man. to prevent the chance. Into the last Let's get 30 minutes now. Nice. Win that by good hell. Just a quick reminder we have more action. Oh, Derek, what a great opportunity! It must go in, surely. Catania with a double. There he is at the double. Catania with a brace, boys, again. He scored two against Sally, and he scored two against Leicester. Well, here it is again. What a ball that is over the top of the defence. It's weighted perfectly, but I think the defending is more. How can the goalkeeper be left so exposed with two players running at him? Mind you, it's still a great team goal. Not too much defending going on. This is what I think Leicester are. Are they like, are they not sacked or something? So this is actually not only is it a good result, it's it's good. This is like a six pointer for us, but we open up that gap. It's a weighted pass. Yes, yeah, post ball. And I'll tell you what, on this sort of ball, very few would lay a glove on them. Well, let's look at this again. Uh, let's make a few wee changes here. Maybe should have made them a wee bit earlier. Get the young fellas on for a wee run out. To pick out this ball shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Thank you, one way for it. Pressing high to win the ball. He's going forward well oh, here. That back post, boys. Well, there's a keeper on song. Well, how did he stop that? That's just unbelievable. Here it is now, a substitution. And there's the delivery. I don't know what happened there. Can he put it in? I was just spamming the tackle button. <laughs> oh, a superb save. And over it 
She so just wander towards the, the strikers there by instead of actually going to the ball. Brilliant result, boys. Brilliant result. Just to put it this quid sag, I'm not sure. Liverpool won the United drop points. Not that we're in the title race, but I'm only staying that. We need to just open that gap up to fifth who are Chelsea at the minute. It's a five point gap at the minute. Let's see, we'll just change them to Let's go boys. Oh they're playing with a five at the back. We might have to change their attacking line up here to match them. Not to well, not match them because they have five at the back, but it changes to our attacking line up where we have three centre backs. Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension packed occasion. Stay with us, we'll have all the action for you live right here. I feel I should have got Billy on. Hello to you, wherever you happen to be. Our action comes to you today from Burpock. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. A glorious chance! Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. So for Aston Villa, you have to say it was a great performance against Leicester City. How do you anticipate oh, it? A great opportunity here. How do you do that? Did his job. No way. Coutinho. John McGinn. Opportunity to the middle of the cross. Sitting there, it's even more weight. Just using the pace. Well, as you can see, what an excellent back hill this is to set up the goal. And it's a great finish. He holds off the defender, keeps his composure, and finds the back of the net. It's a marvelous goal. Not dead there, lads. Just keep it up. So the ball moving again. Will there be a quick reply from Wolves? There needs to be. I'm assuming, I don't understand why that FIFA haven't done it yet, that your like, other clubs come in for you McGinn. to try and like, poach He's them away from a different club, I don't understand why they don't do it, I don't understand, that why, they don't understand why they don't do it, but, you know, the plenty of internationals well, jobs coming to you, why do they miss. not do it, the other clubs come in for you, it doesn't make sense. Well, you never quite know who's going it's to dominate the game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for, that for this fellow, Stuart. Do, really? What do you think we'll see from him today? Well, I think we can expect goals if he scores anything to go by. You just There's something about history back was there for... Uh, really to keep them who do you call him? Isaac? Pedro Neto. Corner 
So we need to make sure we get a goal for him. Well, he thought he might have got away with it, but the referee rightly going back and brandishing the yellow card. Can he deliver it with accuracy? <laughs> what a save off the line there, boys. Spot on with that challenge. Well, let's join Alex Scott because, Alex, I believe there's been a goal in the Burnley match. It's a goal from Manchester City. Oh, to the back post. Many thanks as ever, Alex. There's plenty of know-how in the ball shielding department. Neto. Options in the centre. Coutinho. Teammates available. I'm trying to look for options, but there isn't very much options around here. McGinn. Really good challenge. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Give it to me. I couldn't get on the player, I wanted to be on there, boys. The sloppy in possession. That wasn't for him, that was fairly by Isaac. Couldn't keep it. Then Donka. Could be troublesome. Oh dear. Find the keeper out. I didn't think he'd be able to cheat chip the keeper from there to be honest. The confidence to try that. Simply magnificent. So a level contest. One one. We're not too good at keeping clean sheets. What can they do from here? No, that was too good. Just missed that little bit of attacking spark. Goalkeeper's ball. Coutinho. Oh, as well, close. from the defensive point of view, that he was able to make that interception. And with that, the first half opportunity to deliver the cross. I'm gonna get Bailey on now, boys, and that one not around. to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins I thought he'd have been able to use his strength right I understand there's been a goal at Turf Moor Alex Scott can give us details and it's the second goal for Manchester City they're pulled ahead by two with 48 minutes played thanks as always to Alex Scott Well, just to point you in the right direction, we Max have more live games action games from the Premier League games coming games up here on EA TV. It's Aston Villa facing Norwich City. Sam Maxima, target. Well, not oh, quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Lincoln. Lincoln. Raul Jimenez. Vital interception. The danger oh, was very real. Thing, idiot. Goal at Turf Moor is the word. For all the information, let's join Alex. It's a goal for Burnley. They are losing 2-1 with 60 minutes on the clock. Alex, keep it. Can they take the lead? <laughs> What a goal! Oh, that was a class pass by the team over there. The pass wasn't actually for the team, it was actually for the team. Well, just look at the defending here. They made it so easy for him in the end. That's just not good enough. Some fucking fancy pass now. That's a fucking familiar pass there. So, what was the match? 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. A bit 
sloppy in possession. Counter attacking, very much an option. Strong play here. Isaac. He thought he would have the strike. Not to be advised, giving the ball away there. And searching for his second, but the keeper equal to the task. Well, he's looking really lively, isn't he? Every time he gets the ball, he looks a threat. What is he going to hold over? Lincoln. And now Dendonka. Ooh, he nearly got the ball. Jimenez. Might be able to set up the chance. Not very lucky for him again. Raul Jimenez. Pedro Neto. Johnny. Oh, no. No. Oh, really sound goalkeeping. Well, well that had to be a goal, didn't it? Really what a stop that is. Oh, so much of work and game to see. And decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Going short. This could be the equaliser. King of Sand. It is the equaliser. Well, now, that could be a huge turning point in this game. They carry the momentum. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy turvy game this has been. On the attack, it's this to be late drama. Sam Maxima. Sam Maxima. They can bring it out now. Right over to Alex Scott. Alex, tell us all about the goal that's gone in at Turf Moor. Yeah, it's a third goal for Manchester City. It's now 3-1 with 87 minutes played. Many thanks as ever, Alex. Something out the danger. Good looking move, base. Really important piece that. of last ditch defending. Are you joking me? And that is going to be yeah, all for this game. Well, there, we were treated to go. Opportunity to deliver the pass. Damn, he had the ball. Just didn't get enough. Just didn't do enough in front of the net, really. Risk was losing a player. I'm not really too worried about losing him to be honest with you. But again viewers that is going to do it for today's episode. Thanks for tuning in viewers and I hope you're enjoying the series. Um, please don't forget to like the video and share the video and subscribe to the channel and hit the notifications on so you don't miss any episodes. Enjoy the rest of your day viewers. Goodbye.